It was this time last year. Same location, same opponent. But last year I lost to Colwood councillor Judith Cullington, and this year I was determined not to lose. It's the Bike to Work Week commuter challenge and I wanted a rematch. Me on a bike and Judith in her car. I win it. Last year we did the, the Trans-Canada Highway. I think this year we're going to go Old Island Highway. I think it's a really pretty route and uh, it's a little slower but it's shorter. And so I'm thinking that's going to be the way to go this year. So this year I might just have the edge, but I need a faster bike. A huge thanks to Jet at Riders Cycles in Saanich for hooking me up with this fancy new that. ride. And Judith, well, she had a new ride of her own, an electric car, the Nissan Leaf. You might be riding on your bike, I'll be in my car, but we'll both be zero emissions. So we put on our competitive faces and took off from Caldwood Corners just before 7.30. We're in a bit of a back up here, but usually it clears um, past around the, uh, the Admiral's Road, so... So I'm hoping that we'll make up speed at that point in time. Still planning on beating me. Meanwhile, I'm still adjusting to this bike. Unfortunately, I had no idea it was going even better for Judith. We're making pretty good time. I think Nikki's in trouble. I'm, I'm thinking we're going to win again for sure this year. Parking and paying is also part of the driver's responsibility, and I was hoping that would buy me some time. But Judith had her game face on and was practically running across the finish line. Where's Nikki? I think we won. Yes, it's true. Judith left me in the dust, and I rolled in just over five minutes later. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. It was fun. It was fun. It was fun. Next year. That's right. But yeah. overall, the bike commuters <laughs> did well. It was 15 to 3 in favor of the riders, and there were two ties. Jack Knox from the Victoria Times Colonist was one of the winners, but he took that cushy bike lane down Blanchard from Uptown. So to celebrate his win, I asked him what advice he has for people looking to try out a two-wheeled commute. No one should be intimidated into feeling that they have to go fast or that they have to ride in the rain or have to ride in any manner in which they're not comfortable. Biking should be fun and easy. The commuter challenge marks the unofficial kickoff to next week's Bike to Work Week. The whole purpose of this is to get people to try cycling as a viable transportation op uh, option for commuting to and from work. We're hoping to see a thousand new people try it. We know from our, our registration so far we have over 500 teams. We're hoping to have over 600 teams. So dust off that old bike and join 7,000 people on the South Island who will be biking to work next week. And the payoff? You don't have to go to the gym when you're done. In Victoria, I'm Nikki Ewanishan for The Daily.